we created the star image of the artist by using her body language and um, the sets as well. So the colours were quite surreal because that's the image we went for. This was our theme for our three products to yeah. expand that bright colours, lighting and having that surreal effect yeah. towards everything. Yeah. So as for the artist uh, herself, um, we basically went for this innocent girl next door look, like friendly, um, very innocent girl. Which connects to our target audience. The DigiPack shows Jen's creativity. Um, the, the pattern and the text on the exterior of the album cover is bright, colourful, interesting and quite stylized. On the interior of the album cover, the ne negative of the outside is used, so it is like reversed. This is artistic and eye-catching. Um, the stylish font mirrors Jen's sound and shows that she is current. The album cover contrasts with the video, though, and, and the website representation of the artist, as they show her to be like the girl next door. Um, in the website, we decided to show her creativity and originality. To do this, we um, used a range of colours, so like the blues and the pinks. Um, this fitted in well with our sets and our music video as well. Um, we chose a lot of photos to put on the website as well to represent her look. Um, but the, in the focus group feedback we got, we were told that she looked quite like the girl next door rather than what we originally had our idea of. The digipack contrasts as it is more representative of the genre rather than the artist herself. We used um, lots of close-up shots because um, we wanted to establish that direct address with target audience, which would create this personal touch. Again, helping the product to sell more. Also in the editing, um, we used a lot of overlaid and cross-dissolved shots um, so that it adds to this surreal atmosphere, um, which we kind of went for. Also, it helped to merge um, the two shots together, making a smooth transition. The audience can feel this alternate reality. They can escape to it, so that also promotes the product. It's the same, um, the same in the shots with musicians, where we try to present the cello and violin musicians. So the cause dissolve effect helped us to uh, make them work with each other while she was singing. Um, the main page of the website contains a music video and um, a DJ bag and the news are telling uh, their audience that um, an album has been just released and the video on YouTube. So uh, this might increase the awareness of the target audience that they can buy now an album online in iTunes or they can buy it in future in some shops. This will increase sales of the album. And also on uh, one of the pages of the website, the audience can see the kickass.com advertisement where, where they can buy tickets for the future concerts of Gen Sykes. In terms of branding, how people would recognize our artist, uh, well, basically f all three products have an impact on that, but the music video has the biggest because it stands out from any other artist by its uh, surrealism, originality, the color scheme and stuff. So when the people watch the music video they and they see it. and they see this, those sets, um, those designs, they clearly have an idea straight away who the artist is um, because you can't really mix them up with anyone else. In terms of branding, the website um, constructs an iconic use of the color scheme. So uh, we used on every page the same background. Um, it's starting from the purple and finishing with the green or other way around, but it works with other two products, with the video and the, with the DJ pack. So also the visual style of the website and uh, the font um, can also construct um, um, kind of a brand for, for Gen Sex. So Every time when the target audience will see this type of style or uh, color, they will have an association with the Gen Sykes brand.